So this week we started using the very latest generation presbyopia correcting lens implant called the Synergy Lens Implant. This lens is made by Johnson and Johnson Vision and it comes prepackaged in what they call the Simplicity Delivery System. This lens is the latest generation. We're starting to use it in June of 2021 and it is a direct competitor to this lens here called the Panoptics made by Alcon. So the Synergy and the Panoptics, in my opinion, are the best two presbyopia correcting lenses available and FDA approved in the United States. So let me walk you through how this lens, the Synergy lens implant, works in theory, how it looks in the eye as we're inserting it during surgery, how it looks through a microscope after surgery, and then we'll interview one of our very first patients who received the lens earlier this week. Let me share with you some slides from Johnson & Johnson Vision, the manufacturer of the Synergy lens. They claim that the Synergy lens has the widest range of continuous vision with the best near vision even in low light conditions. In this head-to-head -head comparison between the Synergy and the Panoptics lens, the Synergy lens, which is the purple line in the graph, outperforms the Panoptics lens for far, mid-range, and near vision. The near vision for the Synergy is in the 2020 range at about 13 inches or 33 centimeters from the eye. To emphasize the near vision superiority of the Synergy versus Panoptics, this graph shows that between 10 and 13 inches from the eye, the Synergy provides clearer near vision than the Panoptics. And across all distances, the Synergy lens appears to deliver better vision than the Panoptics, far, mid, and near. The Synergy lens appears to deliver better image contrast during the day and at night than the Panoptics. Both the Synergy lens and the Panoptics lenses are associated with nighttime halos, which are roughly equivalent. The IntelliLite technology enables the Synergy to outperform the Panoptics in the lathing process of the lens, achromatic technology, and violet light filtration. Here's a surgical video from our first day using the Synergy. This patient is a 51-year-old woman who has pretty good far vision without glasses. She's 20-25. She uses progressive glasses when she wants to see mid-range and up close. She drives without glasses but wants to see better at the computer and up close without having to rely on glasses. About 30% of my surgical patients are like this patient. They want elective premium lens replacement to help them see better with minimal use of glasses across the visual range from far to near. We remove our natural lens and then insert one of our first Synergy lenses. The lens is made of the same acrylic material as the Technus Multifocal and the Symphony lenses. I actually love the lens material and lens platform as it looks absolutely spectacular inside the eye. On her first post-operative day, the Synergy lens looks perfectly centered and clear through our slit lamp microscope. Now let's see how our patient sees the day after her surgery. This way. Okay, so um, you had surgery yesterday to which eye? Uh, to my left eye. And you had the, no, you had the Synergy lens. And to how reliant were you on reading glasses before surgery? 100%. Okay, and what power are they? Do you know? Do you know um, what power reading glasses? Slightly less than two, I believe. Okay, got it. And so let's do a quick test. Your right eye, let me just show. Oh, this was your prescription before surgery. Just a little bit far sighted. And you just wore glasses to see far away. You didn't wear reading glasses. You wore, no, no you just wore glasses to read, but you didn't wear any glasses Correct. to see far away. I have progressives. Um, so I'm on the computer. I absolutely needed them for the computer and right. I absolutely needed them for my phone. Got it. Okay. And so your right eye has not yet had surgery. Correct. Just my left. And just your left. So let's do a quick comparison. Uh, hold this card and use your left hand to cover your left eye. And... Um, this is probably about 18 inches away. 
and then can you let me get this here we go what, can you read this line right here no can you read this line right here no can you read this line right here it's foggy but i'm thinking it's two eight four three okay four, four, so that's nine. the distance and so that's like the 2200 get it to focus yeah that's what my eyes trying to do right now focus and it's not getting yeah, there 20, <laughs> that's the 2200 line and now uh hold the card in your left hand cover your right eye now you're using the synergy lens and you're holding it at about the same distance and you can move the card to whatever distance that gives you the easiest from the bottom clarity from the bottom yeah. can up you read four the... two six seven um three nine and that's the 20 that one there 20 line and then i've got a nine three seven eight two six very good okay and, and that's gets better from there yeah that's about 16 <laughs> inches that'd be great <laughs> Okay, this is a true test. This is a bottle of uh, eye drops. And hold this in your left hand and cover your right eye again. And uh, can you read the label that's in front of you? Yep, manufactured by Bausch & Lomb, a division of Valiant Pharmaceuticals, North America. You're good. <laughs> so how do you, how's the clarity far away? Um, Clarity far away. From your left eye. So like if so you're funny. looking at uh, at that picture over there, how's the, how's the clarity? Uh, it's not clear. Yeah. It's clear. And when we tested year 2020, that's really good. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think, you know, right now it's, it's just a little twitchy, but I'm sure that's because yeah. of the work that was done. Yeah, Otherwise, let me... Good. Let me see here. I'm going to look at your eye um, through, I'm going to zoom in because this lens is made of a different material and let me see how it looks. In a picture? <laughs> yeah. So look toward my finger. Uh -huh. Yeah, there's no reflection at all. So cosmetically, we're not going to have that issue with the light at all. Look, uh, look to your right, up and right, left. Man, no issues, good. To give you an idea of how small the print is that she's able to read at about 16 inches, uh, this is that bottle and the font size comparison. That's just a standard brochure that one would hold. And this is the small font at the bottom of the standard brochure. Yeah, the font size on the bottle is significantly smaller. And she was able to read the tiniest number here at the bottom without glasses. It's outstanding. So as time goes by and we treat more and more patients with the Synergy lens, we'll get a better feel of how it actually performs in practice in the real world. My instinct is that the Synergy lens will become our go-to lens and it will surpass and in, in many ways replace the panoptics lens. And this is the nature of technology in eye surgery and in the world of refractive surgery. As time goes by, every couple of years, there's a new implant that seems to outperform the predecessors. So thanks again for taking the time to watch this video. I hope it was helpful and I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.